All right, we are now here at the Celadon City Gym. Let us go inside. I want to make sure that I've got a good lineup here. Well, I actually want to start off with my Golbat. Why not? Let's put that Soothe Bell to use, shall we? I should tell you about this gym. Only real ladies are allowed in here. <laughs> So Celadon City is the grass type gem. So I've got a couple Pokemon that are really good for this type of gem. Last K. So you start off with a Bellsprout. And of course, Golbat is one particular Pokemon that is good, that is really well suited for this gem. Because flying type attacks work very well on grass types. One hit. Boom! Take that. And next is going to be a Weeping Bell. Let's keep using Golbat. Will this take down the Weeping Bell in one hit? Yes, it does! Wow! Sweetness. Ah, almost leveled up. Easy win. You are too rough. <laughs> Alright, let's do another one. Oh, welcome. I was getting bored. <laughs> well, allow me to entertain you. Beauty Bridget. Let's go send out an Oddish. Ah, what am I doing? I was kind of rushing a bit too quick there. Stunts for... Ah! Man, that's a shame. That's a shame. I still went first. How about that? <laughs> Despite that. And still not leveled up. Give me a break. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of that paralysis. Uh, Paralyze heal. I'll need to buy more of those. Wrap. Ah. Uh, well, at least that wrap's not gonna do that much. Get out of here. Golbat is no longer wrapped up. <laughs> Level 30. Yeah. You know, let's just keep using Golbat. Let's just make this fight all Golbat. Yeah, I want to make sure I had Wing Attack selected. <laughs> I was being a bit too hasty there. And another Bell Sprout. No problem. Man, we're just making this gym look easy. <laughs> All right, so we got you. My makeup! <laughs> what? Golbat is evolving! <laughs> you guys bought into that, did you? I gotcha! <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> I'm sorry, I just had to show that. <laughs> I just had to. <laughs> I can't I can't stop laughing. I really can't stop. <laughs> look, look, see my Pokemon. I like the grass type. I like how they're easy to raise. I'm sorry. I just had to show that. But here's the deal. Uh Beauty Tamia. Uh, just gonna send out a bell sprout. The thing is, I have to have the national decks before my Golbat can evolve into a Crobat. Because, of course, <laughs> um, uh, you know, that's just how it has to be. So we can get the other, uh, like the Johto and Hoenn Pokemon. Hey, Charmeleon level 30. So, yeah, like I said, you have to have the national decks in order to uh, evolve Golbat into a Crobat. I just had to show that because I actually thought that was really silly the first time that happened. <laughs> with a question mark I mean, with the evolution just stopped random you know just stopped no with a question mark I had to show that I just had to I had to show that off weren't you peeking in here earlier uh no there's another person outside you should look outside picnicker Tina just gonna start off with hey, a Bulbasaur. Starter versus starter. Let's go. Ah, 
Oh, didn't even take down the Bulbasaur in a single. Oh, Sleep Powder. Ah. Well, I don't think he has a. I don't think that Bulbasaur's attacks are going to really do that much. So, let's see what it's going to do. Razor Leaf. Oh. Ow! Still nine damage. Come on, get up. Thank you. Very good. And send out an Ivysaur. Ah, uh, Ivysaur. Bulbasaur's evolved form. No fair. You get to. Oh. That was almost the exact same amount of damage. Oh, Razor Leaf again. You know, it's not fair that you're able to have two of the same starters, while me, I'm only stuck with one. That's not fair. But yeah, nice experience there. You're an eye-opener. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, we do need to have a cut in order to get into the last uh, couple battles here. Gonna do that. Welcome to Celadon Gym. You better not underestimate the nice ladies here. To all those that underestimate the women in this world, screw you. Cool trainer Mary. Let's gonna start off with a Bell Sprout. She's got five Pokemon. But this will be easy breezy. Of course, took down a Bell Sprout with a single hit. Next, next up is going to be an Oddish. Not really going to be able to uh, utilize the uh, uh, my other... Oh, come on! Stun Spore! Get out of here! I'm not really going to be able to utilize my other Pokemon uh, throughout many of these fights. However, I could use my Nidoking, because Nidoking still has Peck, which is a flying-type move. Oh! Super Potion. Man, I just got back to full health. Get out of here. Man. Ah, burn! Burn, baby! Oh! Stun Spore again. Stop that! Man, I'm getting tired of that. I'm wasting all these paralyzed heals because of that. Didn't even level up. Alright, Weeping Bell. I'll keep Charmeleon in here. Need to at least make Charmeleon level up. <laughs> Growth! You're gonna waste your turn doing that? You could at least take advantage of me while I'm para uh, paralyzed. Paral par par paralyzed. <laughs> Jay paralyzed. <laughs> that goes to you, my buddy, uh, Jason par Paradise. Jay paralyzed. <laughs> Level 31 Charmeleon. Uh, Gloom. Uh, I think I'll go ahead and switch to. I'll switch to my Nido King. At least the grass type that moves will be neutral effective against Nido King. But luckily, I still got Peck. Ah, only half damage. Stun Spore, thank you! Phew! Thank you for not connecting. Get out of here. Alright. Last but certainly not least is an Ivysaur. How come she gets to have an Ivysaur, too? Yo, critical hit! Good night! Woo! Level 30, Nido King. That's right, folks. Oh, beaten! <laughs> Alright. I think I should uh, switch to my Nido King. But the cool thing is, now that I know that my Golbat's friendship uh, level is pretty high. Oh, hey! We don't like bug or fire type Pokemon in here. Or how about flying? This. Flying type Pokemon count on your list. Last Lisa. Send out an Oddish. And of course, she didn't point out poison, because of course, poison type attacks are effective. On oh! Getting sick of them using stuns for. Her. They're making me waste up all my paralyzed heals. I may as well just save them until we get ready for the gym leader battle. Not gonna do that much there. See ya. Uh, as I was saying, poison type moves are super effective on uh, uh, the the uh, poison type attacks are super effective on grass types. But most of these grass types are like they're grass and poison. So 
don't think it would really work out. <laughs> Use both that those turns using Sweet Scent to lower my evasiveness. How good's that gonna do? And I did not even get paral affected by paralysis even once. Amazing. <laughs> oh, you! You! <laughs> Alright, last trainer battle. Pleased to meet you. My hobby is Pokemon training. Isn't that everyone's hobby? <laughs> Beauty Lori. Only has one Pokemon. It's an Execute. Uh, this could be pretty bad, because Execute is... Could... Uh, well, not only did he use Leech Seed, but... <laughs> I think it could have confusion. Oh, okay. If I just say it with one more peck and I'll be good to go. Well, maybe not anymore because I was just leech seeded. Ah, that leech seed. Reflect. That raises that physical defense. Still not affected by. Wow, it's not even doing it that much anymore. I should just switch to my Charmeleon. You know what? That's exactly what I'm going to do. Switch to my Charmeleon. So I can work around that reflect. It better not have light screen too. Oh, confusion. Good thing I switched then. Ow, critical hit! Get out of here. Oh. Gotcha! Worked my way around that reflect. Nice try. Oh, splendid! Such a shame it had to end like that, but oh well. Gotta use my two paralyzed heals. I need to remind myself that I need to get some more after we're done with this gym battle. And Nido King. Yeah. All right. Need to go ahead and use up some of these potions here to heal up. Eat that super potion. I wonder how the Char I wonder how Charmeleon was able to do that. Is going to use up one of my potions too, my regular potions. Hey, that potion matches Nido King's color. <laughs> All right, this time I'm gonna have Gold out on the front. All right, here we go. Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome. My name is Erica. I am the leader of Celadon Gym. I am a student of the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are solely of the grass type. Oh, I'm sorry. I had no idea that you wished to challenge me. Very well, but I shall not lose. Alright, fourth gym battle against the Celadon City Gym Leader, Erica. She's going to start off with a victory bell. So right away, I'm going to immediately Confuse it. And thank goodness for Confuse Ray. I don't have to rely on Supersonic, because Confuse Ray has a 100 uh, accuracy rating of 100. Thank goodness for that. Oh, actually, oh, thank goodness it missed the Stun Spore. <laughs> thank goodness Stun Spore doesn't have a accuracy rating of 100, eh? Oh, wow! <laughs> Take that! Okay, what's going to happen? What's going to happen? Oh, man! Getting tired of that happening. I hate that. Come on. Come on, please. Please make it through. Please make it through. Please make it. Yes! Oh! Made it! Got the victory bell. Get out of here. Woo! Good experience right there. Next up is going to be Tangela. Um. Uh. I think I'll go Charmeleon next. All right, Tangela. Bit of a level gap there, don't you think? <laughs> oh, single hit. Take that. All right, last but certainly not least is Vile Plume. Uh, I want to put Needle King, but I want to get Golbat to level up too. I wonder, I wonder if we have to deal with that funny evolution process every time uh, Golbat levels up. All right, here we go. Acid. It's not going to do that much. Wow, only seven damage. Okay. At least I carried out Confuse Ray. No 
Okay. Ah, oh, full heal. Get out of here. At least I can land a hit. Oh, I thought I was going to land a free hit, but I guess not. Acid. That's probably your only way around <laughs> uh, uh, attacking me, because none of your grass type moves that will do squat to go bat. Okay. Does not have any other full heals. Good. Ah, but still carried out the attack. Come on now. Please let me carry out my attack. Thank you. Very good. Ah, good damage. Snap that of confusion. Okay, well that's all right. As long as it carries out the attack. Please, 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 please. Thank you. That's it. That's it. Gotcha. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. Level 31 Golbat. Take that. <laughs> that's a rhyme for you. There you go. Oh, I can see defeat. You are remarkably strong. I must come for you on you the rainbow badge. And 2,900 Poké Dollars. Yes, we gotta go through that again. <laughs> okay. I wish I could just stop immediately. <laughs> that is just funny. It just ends up with a question mark. The rainbow badge will make Pokémon up to level 50 obey. It also allows Pokémon to use strength in and out of battle. Please also take this with you. TM19 from Erica. TM19 contains Giga Drain. Half the damage it inflicts is drained to heal your Pokémon. Wouldn't you agree that it's a wonderful move? Truly wonderful indeed. Be a better attack than Absorb, that's for sure. But I don't think I want to use it up just yet. Alright, before we leave Celadon City, there's a couple things I'm gonna want to buy. Uh, I didn't want to do that. I'll go ahead and heal up my Pokemon really fast. Then I'll do a little shopping. Because, of course, i got to get those Paralyzed heals again. Maybe a couple of additional healing items as well. And a couple of other stuff while we're here. Okay, so first off, we're going to head up into the second floor. One of the vendors, I think it's this one right here. That gives us the healing items. Yes, it is. Okay, good. Paralyzed heal for... definitely. Uh, let's start off with... Uh, let's get ten of these. Personally, I wish there were more full heals, so I wouldn't have to just buy, you know, many... many of the uh, different... Uh, types of heals, you know? And I'll have an, maybe a couple of ice heals while we're at it. Just in case. Okay, our next step is going to be the fourth floor. I can't believe I kind of forgot to do this kind of shopping earlier. Forgot about this vendor over here. But look what we can get here. There's a Poké Doll. Uh, retro mail, and we can get the different elemental stones. So that's pretty cool. I'm definitely going to want to have a leaf stone. And I'm not positive I'm going to use the thunderstone. I might. But I'll go ahead and hold on to it just in case if I feel like doing it. We'll see. I'm not positive about the thunderstone, but I'll hold on to it just in case. But the leaf stone, I know for a fact I'm going to use. Alright, so that's all the shopping I'll do. And that means our next destination will be over here. Actually, as a matter of fact, I need to uh, put one of my Pokemon in the box really quickly. I'll go ahead and put, um, well, I, actually, no, I don't need to have the, uh, Oddish with me, so I'll temporarily put Oddish to the side.
But of course I'll get that Oddish back with me after we go tackle this bit. So we can go into the back of the uh, Pokemon Mansion here. And if you in go in here... There is nothing that I don't know, like I wrote on the blackboard. I know about the world of Pokemon and your Game Boy Advance. Get together with your friends and enjoy training Pokemon. But over here, you see there's a Pokeball on this desk. Now you must make sure there is one open slot in your party, because this Pokeball is... an Eevee! Ooh, let's have a look at our new Eevee, shall we? <laughs> oh, wow, I actually wound up with a female Eevee. I'm getting lucky with the females here. Ooh, a... A jolly female Eevee. <laughs> Ooh, quite the friendly one, huh? So how about that? We can get an Eevee at this point. Pretty cool level, too. Unfortunately, Eevee's not going to be a main part of my lineup. But it's always nice to have an Eevee. <laughs> oh, also... Funny how we got Pikachu and Eevee in our party. I need to really start playing those Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevees. Uh, EV games. I've got both, but I'm really debating on which one I should go, uh, should play first. I mean, besides, I'm trying to go through all the other Pokemon games as uh, LP, so I'm kind of waiting on. I'm really waiting until the time I decide to play one of the Let's Go games on which one I should play first. So, like I said, Eevee's not going to be a part of my main lineup. I really hate to do this to my Eevee. Because, I mean, who doesn't who doesn't love Eevee? Everybody loves Eevee. <laughs> okay, I need to get my Oddish back in. And these are some of the other Pokemon that I caught uh, off-screen, as you can see there. That tells you everything you need to know on what Pokemon, what Pokemon I caught. <laughs> Alright. So that about wraps up everything here in Celadon City for the time being. And our next destination is going to be Saffron City. We're not going to go inside the uh, uh, building just yet. And we can't get inside the gym because that Team Rocket guy is blocking the way. But there's an additional gym in here. So we'll be going through there. 